Hello everyone, welcome back to Aqua Visuals. So I was watching Blade Runner 2049 and got inspired by this specific scene and wanted to recreate it in Blender. As you all know, I have done various cinematic scene recreations in my past videos. But this one is more challenging because it involves water caustics. While there are many ways to create water caustics in Blender, most of them are too time consuming. Now with the idea, let's start designing the scene and the environment. To begin with, I am going to use a software called FSpy. The download link is in the description. It estimates the focal length, orientation and position of the camera in the 3D space using vanishing points, which are specified by aligning two line segments with parallel features in the image. You can adjust the X and Y vanishing points and zoom in with shift or precise adjustments. Also adjust the pivot point which will be used as origin in Blender. Once you are satisfied, save the project. Next, open Blender, go to File, choose Import FSpy and load the save project. This will bring the camera with the reference image into Blender. Now add a cube and a plane, scale and extrude them to build the stairs in the room. The rest of the process is just a time lapse of extruding and adjusting it to the reference image. Once the room is ready, set the render engines to cycle and device to GPU compute. Set the background color to black. For lighting and water caustics, add a spotlight and move it above the stairs. Increase the light intensity and rotate it slightly, which will be used as fill light. Now for the water caustics, duplicate the light, then in the shader editor, select the spotlight, enable use nodes, add the water caustics PNG image and connect it to the emission node. Enable texture coordinate nodes by pressing Ctrl T on the image texture. Experiment with the light settings such as radius, spot size and blend until you are satisfied. Now change the light colors according to the reference image. Also this is a pretty simple trick and the fastest method to create water caustics in Blender. Now for the materials I am using Blender Kit add-on in which I am applying the plaster texture to all the elements. Then in the UV editor adjust the scale of the texture. So you are done, go for the final render, do some color grading and appreciate your work. So if you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe for more content like this. You can also follow me on Instagram where I post some amazing cinematic visuals.